guys and welcome back to Newslick. Uh, on our today's news, we're going to talk about Ed Indichu, who is Paul, uh, who is Janet Mbugwa's ex-husband. And we really do not know the reason why they broke up with Janet Mbugwa, even though uh, people are speculating there is violence and cheating involved. So what happened yesterday at Ole Sereni is that uh, these two gentlemen, like you can see, this is Paul Ndichu, who is the twin brother to Andy Ndichu. Yesterday they were involved in a fight. They, there was a fight that broke up at Ole Sereni where they were fighting for a woman. So this is the wife of Paul Ndichu, who is Mo, a manager at Safaricom, and it is also being speculated that they have also broken up. So I really don't know what's happening, but these two brothers, these two twin brothers, were involved in a fight at Ole Sereni, fighting for a woman, and it was very, very ugly. So as you can see on the screen is Janet and Eddie, uh, Paul and Mo. And here is the video of the things that happened. No, no. No, Chilimo, Chilimo, Chilimo. No, Chilimo. So for the record, the one who's wearing a white polo shirt uh, and, and, and breaking the car side mirror, that's Paul Ndichu. And the one in a fight is Andy Ndichu, uh, Janet Mbugwa's ex-husband. Uh, there are comments from people who work at Ole Sereni. This is what they had to tell Edgar Barre because this is courtesy of Edgar Barre. Uh, the comments are long, so uh, please pause the video and read the comments uh, by yourself. Uh, but you can see uh, they were all drunk, they were having a good time. They were also themselves, the twin brothers, they were having their own ladies who were partying with them, but they were also hitting on other girls who had come uh, to the party. And because it was around 3 a.m. at night, there were not many people in the rooftop of Ole Sereni. So that is when now hell broke loose and they started... Uh, you know, insulting the girls who had turned their advances down. So, um, yeah, please post the comments and read for yourself. This is, this is all I could get. And also, if you haven't subscribed, guys, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel. Also, leave a comment down below and tell us uh, what you think about the whole idea. Do you think it is right for men to engage in uh, violence towards women? Leave a comment and tell us what you feel. And if you have any uh, other news, you can also leave them at the comments. And from us here at Newsleak, that's it for today. Uh, see you in the next one. Bye-bye.